Hello everybody and welcome back to Stellaris, where we are currently, well, half of us are at war. I'm not at war, so that's exciting. I am at war though, and that's exciting. Construction complete. Why do you have a fleet with 561 power? <laughs> oh, it's joining your other fleet. I see. Construction complete. Huh? Are you talking about the one in Defada? Yeah. It's being joined by your fleet in, uh... Special project complete. Oh, I found Marauders. Yeah, it's being joined by Fly. Those Marauders are potentially going to be handy for me. I can hire them to go after the Jade Falcons. Right now, the plan is have Fluffy push through the bottom part complete. solo, because that's 521, so it can do that pretty easily, and then have the other two push through the top part where all the four. Yeah. Construction complete. Makes sense. I don't know whether I actually want to go up to take Aculum, though. Maybe I'll leave that for you. Well, my plan is to at least take enough so that I can get to the Enigmatic the Fortress. The spirits have granted us yeah. new wisdom. Which technically is only one system. Hmm, fusion reactor or plasma thrower? That's a tough call. Ooh, that's not... Wait, is it not... Does my fleet actually counter them? No, it doesn't. Fleets are very stupid in this game sometimes. By the way, just so you know, they are using entirely kinetic weapons. System survey complete. I'm looking at their destroyer here. It's got coil guns and auto cannons and flak batteries. Their, cor their corvettes just have auto cannons, so they are purely kinetic. I recommend switching to armor. Yeah. If you're not already on armor for your corvettes, anyway. I personally don't put shields on my corvettes, because I like to have the excess power, so that they have I the have no invasion idea. rating. Mine's on auto right now, so I have no idea what they're on. Complete. Oh, I don't do my ships on auto, usually. Oh, there's actually a system in the space where my people can repair. That's a nice... Also, unemployed pops. Let's make an energy district. Oh, would you look at that? They rivaled you. Oh boy, who would have thought? Right? There we go. Galactic, Galactic market. Market. That's nice. The market leader is the Empire of Belm. We never even got any events to set up the market. Somebody else set it up. No. That makes me sad. I'll just have to conquer him, I suppose. Obviously. I don't even see those people anywhere. They're unidentified to me. In the market, I can see that they're the Empire of Belm, but it's when I mouse over it, it's an unidentified empire. System survey complete. Oh no, you're sending a hundred and eighteen Corvette fleet after me? I'm so s Whatever will I do? That is terrifying right there. 
By the way, as far as defenses go, they have an equal mix between armor and shields. Yeah, I'm gonna probably set up my ships after those stuff right now. I'm just gonna go ahead and keep it up. That's a 607, but that still doesn't scare me considering my main one's a 1.5k. Wait, what? How did they get behind me? That's Construction not good. complete. Their fleet is actually just sitting there in Veyr. Yeah, I They're can see that. They're not doing anything. I'm just gonna send Fluffy. Construction complete. And then keep pushing forward through Mephra. Because they don't have anything that can actually contest me other than what's in Veyr, and if I send Fluffy there, then... They're... Yeah. What I want to do is go ahead and grab Aldib and Usaladon, and then status quo. Because then I can expand south. Oh, these guys declared rivalries on me. Their fleet power is overwhelming compared to mine, probably because I'm only at 26 ships right now. <laughs> Not really focused on shipbuilding, but I'll be able to build ships very quickly if I need to. So do you plan on doing a cocktail war to get the, um, Aculum and Theron system? The Great Finu Regime just guaranteed the Skinnery, so no. Construction ah. complete. I can't Special take both of them. Special project complete. They won't participate in this war, though, because I'm already with them. Correct. Okay, then that's good. And they stopped guaranteeing the Skinnery. That lasted that a long time. Did. That lasted, like, what, 20 days? Something like that. It's a little awkward. Just slightly. Come on, Fluffy, go ahead and just take that so I can move on. System survey complete. Of course, as soon as I start heading south, they go ahead and fight against us. I'm gonna have one space just in the middle of them in Otron, I think, by the end. Wait, what am I doing? I should just split up my fleet. Construction complete. System survey complete. So I can't really plan my invasion until I know what exactly you're taking, so I'll probably wait on the Coattail War. Yeah. Right now what it's looking like is I'm going to take Vare, Otron, and the entire southern part. That's what it's looking like at least. Okay. Though I may lose Otron, I'm not sure yet. Situation log updated. 
Oh, there go my edicts again. And I actually can't afford to renew them this time. Oh well. Not the end of the world. Construction complete. I do believe I require additional alloys. Luckily, I am getting some. There's just no reason to status quo this yet. I'm just destroying them everywhere, like... Yeah. Oh, there you go. You status quo them, I guess. No, I didn't. Complete. Oh, it was enforced? Yeah. Okay. That sucks, because I had Odron and Vare. Yeah. Construction complete. Yeah, I should have just status quoed there at the end. But whatever. Oh, okay. The Finu regime entered into a defensive pact with them, so I can't coattail it. However, now I can just build a system in Alvira. Just an even longer worm. Oh boy. You're not wrong. I need to sell some of my minerals. I'm at cap now. I usually sell the majority of my minerals on a monthly complete. basis because you don't really need a large number of minerals coming in, you just need some minerals. Yeah, not anymore. Yep. Not since they changed the system from minerals to alloys for ships, at least. Mm -hmm. Anomaly found. The only thing you really need minerals system for is building stations. Complete. Yeah. Now and I just need to remember how to set the uh, complete. system up as the home system for stuff. I did not follow that. Yeah, no, I imagine. <laughs> Um, I'm talking about, like, System setting up a complete. shipyard to be the home shipyard of a place. Oh, yeah. Yeah, uh, you do, you set complete. that by basing the fleet in the fleet selection. Um, yeah, and then you select, you just click on the home base yeah. and then set the home base. Which the home base for, the, for all of these should be the Weizen Station. Right now, I'm setting all mine to Zadron, because I do plan on going to another war against them the eventually. Have granted us new wisdom. Mm. Those two really like each other, I guess. Yeah, they do. Ooh, fleet command limit plus 20. That is going to be handy. Currently, my naval cap is 66, and my fleet command limit is 50. Nice. The spirits have granted and us once again, wisdom. low on consumer goods. System survey complete. Well, you know, that's one of the benefits of microing your planets. Yeah. That sort of thing doesn't happen. Now I need to micro my sh
Okay, I think I'm done now with my internal expansion. The Great Regime cut me off a little bit from my expansion down this way, though, so I need to race down this way. Actually, I need to do that now. Yeah. I need to take Gossick if I can. Construction complete. That is of utmost importance to me. Alright, I now have a shipyard in Zidran. That's really cool, too. ship down here. But all my science ships are super far away, obviously. As they tend to be. Well, they have three years to get there. If they don't get there, and well, then that sucks. Thanks, Progenitors. What they get? Plus 25% research in every category. Nice. They're nice frogs. I just got Ion Thrusters. Cool. Very nice. It is, however, time to put a cut in here. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. And next episode, we will see if I manage to cut these guys off. Subscribe for more, and we will see you guys next time.